this is my review of the Lego City Mail uh, Airmail Plane number seven seven three two, and it comes with one minifigure, and uh, he's got your basic black pants, a mail uniform with the uh, little letter here, and a pocket with a pin on it, with a pin sticking out of it. And um, for his face, he's got a little smile and some sunglasses with gray shades. And he kind of looks like he's frowning, sort of an evil smile. Probably because he just made a kill. <laughs> but anyway, on to the main plane. You get this neat little plane with uh, lights on the side. And from the front on the left, uh, there's this green light. And from the back on the left, there's a red light. And of course, naturally with all planes, you have to have the back fins and uh, this, whatever it's called. And it's got a neat little decal on the side. You get the male logo right here. And you get these two propellers that spin. They spin. You get a basic blue car windshield that comes with it. And uh, you get some landing gear that's easily detachable. See? And, uh, on the top here, to get the, um, and on the top here to get the package out, it, it has a little antenna there. You can open it up and take that off and take that off to reveal several areas for storing airmail. And it comes with this one little package. It's gray. And it's got a little uh, glass on it, meaning fragile, and the address on it. On it. And of course, it's just a basic Lego brick underneath. Now, there's not really much else to the set. And, uh, it's really nice. It's about $15. Um, it might have been just a wee bit overpriced, but, uh, it's still neat to play with. And I really think every city, and I really think every city should have one. So, uh, if you see one, be sure to pick it up. Alright, that's my review.